Santa Barbara County is looking to help towns and cities better adapt to extreme weather. KSBY reporter Austin Herbaugh joins us live in the newsroom now with details on the new program. Austin. Community Resilience Centers are new concept that are gaining traction in California. Three of these centers are now coming to Santa Barbara County. From wildfires and drought to torrential flooding, California is no stranger to a wide range of natural disasters. To help towns and cities better prepare, Santa Barbara County has chosen three locations for so-called community resilience hubs. All of these sites are located either in or close to uh, low-income areas. Uh, for Nukuyama, obviously, they're very remote and rural. The centers are meant to provide services like electricity during widespread power outages or a place to breathe clean air when a region is choked in wildfire smoke. The hubs will be located at the Franklin Neighborhood Center in Santa Barbara, Girls Inc. of Carpinteria, a nonprofit aimed at empowering young women, and the Blue Sky Center in Nukuyama, which fosters economic development in the Cuyama Valley. Blue Sky Center, our property, was built by Richfield Oil Company, ARCO, back in the 1940s. 50s, as well as the whole town site of New Kuyama for their worker housing. The executive director of the Blue Sky Center says they have the infrastructure to build an emergency center with seven buildings totaling 24,000 square feet, an airport, and 267 acres. And so we are a, a small community, about 1,100 people, but we really have an ethic here of being able to get things done and to work together to overcome pretty um, extreme things. It's already like a, an ethic that we already have here. We're already looking out for each other as neighbors. That's already a high value that Kuyamans have is to look out for each other. The centers are being paid for by 25,000 in funding from PG&E and another 200,000 from the California Resilience Challenge. We're aware that the state and federal government are investing well, significant amounts of money in local adaptation for climate change. And so we do believe that there will be a lot more funding in the future. Now the goal is to have more of these centers pop up in places like Lompoc and the Santa Maria Valley. In the newsroom, Austin Herbal, KSBY News. Santa Barbara County will begin working with organizations hosting the centers as early as next week. The county says it will take about six months to finalize what the center will look like. There is no exact timeline for when they will open.